This video is part of our series of videos on picture framing. In this video we try to show you how to create a shape to be used with your mats. We start off by drawing a shape in another program. It's important that the shape to be used as the opening is a distinctly different color than the background. Save the image in a PNG file format. Now we can switch over to custom frame. Select our mode shortcut, image cap. We're going to add a capture screen from files. Find the image, the shape that we created. Scroll down here. And there it is. Oh. And now we'll select a region of this image for our shape. Select region as shape. And we open up marquee and try to have a, an equal amount of trim on each side of the shape. Okay. Now save as file. This file is going to have a transparent area. Adjust the fuzziness. Fairly high level, but not quite a thousand. Select on the area to be made transparent. And OK. We'll save it as a EMF file. This is an enhanced meta file. And we call it octagon. Octagon and save. We can now close out the capture screen. Drag a mat in. Select the edit shortcut or the edit button on the right the hand side of your mat tab. Edit edge shape. Now we have to add our new shape to this list. Add new shape. There's the octagon EMF file. Open. Give it a name and confirm OK. Check and there it is on the list. Select octagon and OK. Do open. And there it is as the shape for our mat. Let's bring an image in. Let's go back to mats. Select a second mat position. And bring a second mat in. Bring a frame in. And there's our project with a shaped opening. Custom Framer can handle moderately uh, complex shapes. If you want to deal with very complex shapes, uh, at this point you have to keep it down to a single matte layer. Please visit www.artframer.com to download the 30-day trial of Custom Framer.